All right, so a lot of times I go to the wrecking yard to get, you know, like a fuse box or something for an old car. Um, I notice all the relays are missing. So a lot of times people, when they think something's wrong with their car, they ask, you know, one of the first things they ask is, is it, is it a relay? Do you think it could be a relay? And um, honestly, relays don't fail very often. We might replace one in my shop maybe less than 10 a year. And, um, you know, we got three full-time technicians that work on just VW, Audi, BMW, and Porsche. So it's not common. But if you want to see if a relay's bad, all you really need to do is pop a screwdriver in between. Let's put it back in there. That, uh, hang on a second. Okay. So all you need to really do is just pop a screwdriver in between in that gap right there and pry it open. And relays normally are very clear to identify. This one smells like burnt campfire smell, like fire that you put out with water or like a candle that you blew out. And then um, if you look over here, you can clearly see the damage right there. There's a little uh, piece of metal that's burned. And not only that, if you look over here, the contacts are burned for that component as well so don't just go throwing relays in the car they're expensive especially for quality like original ones um, pry it open smell it look for burnt contacts and um, they'll save yourself a lot of money in the long run